Hello, I'd like to welcome you back to EMR Hosting Solutions Open EMR video training series. In this video we're going to learn how to make new and established patient appointments. First a little review. In the last video we learned how to set up the calendar properly. If anything ever needs to be changed, just double click on provider, in office, lunch, out of office, reserved, put in the time, the duration, and when it does repeat, then just hit save. And this will come up. You can either do it in just the current if you want to change it just for today, or all future ones, or just all. The same goes for the setting up the lunch every day. This will help organize the calendar. Now the first thing we're going to do is we're going, we're going to set up an established patient appointment. So when the patient calls, it says, and then over the phone they said they want a 10 o'clock appointment. Just come over here to the left side, click on 10 o'clock. I will bring up the screen here. And if it's a st an established patient, you can either leave it as the office visit or established patient, whichever way that your office normally does it. And then input the patient's name, go my last name, as a search, it's John Wayne, just hit save. There it's saved. As you see, it's color coded, coded just like all the rest of them. And if you don't like how the colors are set up, you can always change them by just going down to administration, going down to other, and calendar. Right up here in categories, this is where all the categories are set up. Either add new or establish patient, which is right here. You can pick the color right in this area. You can pick any one of these you want if, if you don't like how the color is set up. But we'll just leave it at default. Just scroll all the way down to the bottom. Just hit go. That would save any of your changes. We'll go back to the calendar now. So next we're going to set up an established patient. So when a patient calls and said they want to make an appointment, you ask them if they're new or established. If they're new, this button right up here, new patient, just click. That will bring up this screen. Search or add for a patient to the bottom section here. Now to speed this process up and to not use a whole lot of time on the phone, so if someone calls up, they said, I would just like to make an appointment. All you need is the first name, last name, then you can ask them the date of birth or just put today's date in and just wait till they get here and you can always change that and male or female and create new patient it always does a search which is found patient now? yes back to the calendar. If they want to get in at 10.30, we just click here. Patient. Add new patient. 
and hit save. And you will see that this has a different color to it. And it's a half an hour patient for new. As you see, that this really helps keep it organized. So if you know if a new patient's coming in, if you have to get the sheets ready or other things so they can fill it out, then after they do come in, you can click on their name. Then after you get the information, just go back to demographics. And that will bring up this area here. You got who the person is, got their contact information, different choices for assigning which provider, if they allow a voice message, or text message information when you're contacting them, put in their employer. If you do want to add any stats, this is the area to do it, and miscellaneous. And the next section down is the insurance. Of course, you put in the primary insurance, plan name, policy number, group number, go through all this information here, date of birth, relationships, self, all the pertinent ins insurance information. If they do have a secondary, this is a spot you do it, same thing. Assign them the insurance provider, plan name, go through the group numbers, put all the rest of the information in, in those occasions that there is a tertiary. Just do the same thing on, on this file. Input all their information. And after that's done, just go up to the top and hit save. Then you would have all the insurance information. And here's the here's the general information all in one shot here. You can add some notes. Right in this area, sent items. And again, patient reminders, if you want to add any, of course, any notes, change the demographics at all, it's right in that area. These are all just quick shots. Same here. Add tobacco, the next appointment, medical problems. All you do is you just add them right here. All of these things are required by the federal government for for any program to be certified. So that's how you set up your calendar to take patients and how you input some patients. So thank you very much. In the next video we will see how to update patient records and go through soap notes. Thank you.